Black Knight. Welcome to Girl Code, Woman in Beast Mode. God opens doors round here. No key. Hey, you guys, it's me, Brittany, here, and I'm here doing another album review for you guys. This is Girl Code, and this came out October 22nd. How I came about getting this album, we had a Christian hip hop concert at my church last week, and Thizzle was there. Thizzle is um, also the executive producer of this album, so they were selling it there. So my husband bought it for me, and now that I've been listening to it over and over, it's really grown on me. I really enjoy it. I think the production is great. I think there's great beats. I think the um, hip hop artists that they're great. The vocalist that they have on here is quality vocalists that sing really well. And I just love the whole, the whole overall concept of this album. Um, so the people that I was familiar with, because I'm not familiar with everyone, but um, it has Jackie Hill on here, Butter P, Nona, Natalie Lauren, who's formerly Susie Rock, Jay, V Rose, Marte, Heeson Lee, Chosen, Sicily, Mars, Erica, uh, Danae, I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that correctly, and Christy Lane. So I was familiar with Jackie Hill. She's a spoken word artist. And I think with people who are familiar with her, you know her from P4CM. And I was blessed to have the opportunity to see her live about a month ago. She's an amazing spoken word artist. She flew in from Chicago to attend an Orlando event here. Familiar with Butter P. Natalie Lauren, um, Chosen, and V Rose. The other artists I wasn't familiar with, but I, I enjoyed them just as much as the people who I didn't know about. Um, so the reason why I like the concept of this album, um, Jackie Hill, she starts out with WTTGC, which is Welcome to the Girl Code. And she has a part on there where she says that we've allowed the culture and society to speak for us so long. And I feel like the girl code is giving, allowing women to have their own voice. Because I feel like sometimes the male gender, they try to speak on our behalf. And to even add to why else I love this is because it's, become, it's coming from a Christian woman's perspective. So I really like that. And it's like a peek, you know, into our lives and where we're coming from. So I found it really relatable. Second, well, I will say the first song, but second track is Girl Code, Turn Up, and that's by Chosen. Um, this one's produced by Black Knight, and I think he does, like, the stuff I've heard him on. It's been really great beats. I really, like, this just immediately puts you, like, into the album. You definitely, like, want to blast it. Um, just really, really like it. The third track made for this, this is Butter P, and it features Natalie Lauren. And I like the concept of this song because it's talking about, you know, wanting to make good music and just affecting the world by it. And as I said before, like music is just so influential. So it's just kind of expressing that desire to want to change the world through music and just you know reaching various like generations through it um the next song is secret garden and this one has like a rock feel but i really like it it's by mars he does is the next one that's by v rose i really really like this song um the whole basis behind it was it's basically like when you're in a point where you feel that no one cares or no one loves you that that God loves you and I think it's important to be you know reminded by that because sometimes we get in certain situations and we feel like no one's in our corner but God's always there he always has your back and he just he loves us regardless the next track is Trust in You and it's by Cicely and it features Jasmine Lachey I am familiar with Jasmine Lachey I've heard her on um, one of KB's songs I really think she's a very talented artist and with this particular song it just seemed like a testament to her life. Um, she has had open heart surgery and when I saw a video a couple months ago, um, you might be a little bit older than that, she was trying to raise funds because she was in need of another open heart surgery. And in this song it's basically talking about trusting God, 
no matter the circumstance, no matter what you're going through. And they have a part in there where they say, people say if your faith was stronger, then you wouldn't be going through this. And um, I just think it's good that they kind of mention that. It's like, how can someone else measure like your level of faith, you know, in God? And, um, you know, it just talks about just um, trusting the Lord, like no matter the outcome in her case, whether she's healed or not, she still loves God and she's still going to trust him. Um, I just thought it was a really great song. Um, the next song is You, and that's by Erica Dene, and it features Mamie. Mm, I'm sorry, I don't know how to pronounce her last name. Um, this is talking about just needing needing God. Like, all I need is God. Um, you referring to God. Um, great production, great beat, great mess. Next one is Alive by Jay. And I really like this one because it's talking about going through different circumstances. And, you know, as times you go through th certain things, you feel really defeated you lose you know all hope and this is just talking about like being alive God sustaining you God bringing you through that dark place so I, I like that one the next one was WTHTG and that stood for um I'm trying to remember now we don't have to go and this one like it's kind of like a dance feel like party mix uh, it wasn't really one of my favorites, but I think like the beat is good. Um, and that was by Chrissy Lane. And the next one is One Man Girl by Nona featuring Latoya Wilson. And this is just, you know, expressing like having, you know, your man's back, your, your husband and being committed as, you know, being true to him and supporting him. I really like the message and the concept behind that one. Turn Me Around, that was, was a nice one. Um, that's followed by Satisfied. And Satisfied, um, I don't remember. Oh yes, that one is talking about being, being content in God, being secure in God, not, you know, things of the world and people. Finding that contentment within God. That, at the end of the day, that's the only contentment that's going to last. Other people can be, you know, in and out your life. Material things can be here today and gone tomorrow. So, you know, put your, your trust and hope and build contentment on something that's going to be everlasting, permanent. Um, that, and then after that, it's another spoken word piece by Beautiful Vision. And I think this is, this is great. I think it speaks to, like, insecurities and not being... Sometimes we're not, you know, especially as women, we're not, we question, you know, why God made us a certain way. Um, it could be certain things we question, you know, what our physical appearance, what our personality. And I like with how Jackie Hill ends this because it's kind of talking about with, as we look in the mirror, it's giving us an opportunity to see ourselves in the way that God sees us. And God sees us as beautiful and wonderfully and fearfully made. And then it ends with another song by Mars, and that's called Beautiful Day. Overall, I think it's a, a great album. And I know sometimes I pick out, like, certain lyrics that I like. But honestly, with most of these songs, there was so many, like, lines and lyrics that I liked. And I didn't want to make this a super long video. Um, but definitely... Um, Check it out. Support them. This is a very unique album. Like, whenever I see Christian Hip Hop compilation albums, it's all um, male artists. So, support the girls and, you know, plug in something positive into your, your CD player or your iPod. It's available on iTunes. And, of course, you know, you can order a CD. Um... Yeah, so that was pretty much it. Thank you for watching. All I wanna do is make good, good music. And all I wanna do is change the whole world through.